Hello guys, welcome back to Used and Reviewed. So this is a video that you've all been waiting for. We're going to take a quick look at the Skype app that's now available for the PlayStation Vita. Now you'll probably know what Skype is, but essentially it allows you to make voice calls and video calls over your network to any contact for free. You can also call people uh, on mobile phones, etc. if you've got Skype credit. Now when you load up the app, to start with you're going to be presented with all your contacts or in my case a very small contact list um, the top icon on the right is your profile so here you can change your status change your profile details etc the second tab is your contact list if you have got a large contact list there's a search down the left hand side now I will point out now the most annoying point of this is that you can't add contacts in the Skype app itself which is really disappointing you want to be able to select down here search for friends and, and add your, your contacts you can't you're gonna to have to do it on your PC um, I don't know why they've missed that out maybe it'll be implemented in the future but uh, it's a real disappointment you can however accept contact requests so if someone does send you a request you can accept it here the third tab down is essentially a list of your recent calls and then the final tab is actually allows you to dial a number so if you want to call a landline or a mobile phone cell phone you do it through here using your Skype credit so let's go and make a call and see how we get on so to make a call on the Skype app you want to go to your contacts list Select the relevant person you want to call and then you brought up with a number of options. You can see the profile of that person but also you can make a normal voice call or a video call. So let's try out a video call. Hey Lindsoyd. Yeah, good. It works well. Yeah, it's working brilliantly. You're very clear. Yeah, you too. So, have you got this on Wi-Fi at the moment? This is on Wi-Fi, this end, yeah. Okay, it also works on 3G, but uh, this is on Wi-Fi. Um, and I'll just quickly show you. Uh, you can change the camera to the rear-facing camera. Like so. Nice cat. Hello, Vegas. Uh, Not interested. You can turn the video off so the other person can't see you and you can also mute. So that's it, we'll end the call and we'll see uh, you soon. Hey. See ya. So now I'm going to fire up a game and we're going to see how it Skype app works whilst you're playing. I'm actually going to load up Motorstorm. So, as you can see, I've got an incoming call whilst I'm smashing some scores on Motorstorm. Now, to accept the call, you need to press the PS button. It's no good pressing the notification. Press the PS button, select answer, and it loads of Skype up. Hello, and there we go. Hi, How are you? Yeah, good, you? Just yeah, it's your Motorstorm. Are you getting on? Yeah, all right. Just have a, a, a few laps. Uh, yeah. It w works well, this app. So, uh, it works in-game. Uh, I think um, some some of the games it doesn't work though, so if there's uh, any games that have network features disabled, it, it won't work apparently. So, we'll test that out and we'll let you know as well. Okay All right. mate, sounds good. We'll see you later. See you later. Bye. Bye. And we'll end the call. So everyone, that concludes the video. I hope you liked it. Um, Skype app, yep, yeah, it's a great facility and you're going to be able to call your friends for free. It has got a couple of niggles, you can't add contacts from the device. And I've also heard that the app does have some issues if you've got a very large contact list. 
Um, hopefully Sony will line these out with, with the Skype developers and we should see an update soon. Hope you liked the video. As usual, please rate, leave a comment and subscribe. This has been News and Reviewed. We'll see you all in the next video.